Hey there, service pros. This is Christian from the Workies product team. In this video, we're going to talk about how to label jobs with tags. Tags are a great way of organizing the jobs you have scheduled in Workies. You might use them to indicate when jobs are planned versus on-demand opportunities, or maybe to highlight when your tech should read the notes on the jobs page. Tags will enable you to save time with automated reminders and also help you focus on the jobs that really need your attention by using filters. Let's get started. To label a job with a tag, you'll need to open up a job page. Go ahead and do that by selecting jobs from the sidebar navigation and then selecting a job you want to tag. To quickly assign a tag, you can use the pop-up sidebar on the right to select the tag you want to use. Your Workies account will automatically come with a few default tags ready to go. Estimate, opportunity, and callback. If you want to get a little bit more creative and add a custom tag of your own, you'll want to open the job page by selecting this link right here. From the job page, select the plus icon next to tags up at the top of the page. You'll see a similar setup from the sidebar before, except this time you'll be presented with the option to add a new tag. Doing that is pretty simple. Just enter the name of the tag you want to create and then choose the color you want to use for this tag. Follow up, cash on delivery or COD, warranty, parts on order. Those are just some of the common custom tags we've seen in the past. I'm gonna create a tag called needs part pickup. I'll choose dark green and then hit save tag. Now let's go a bit further and add a job description that we can use later on. We'll say part required, security 600 Deadpool. Okay, now that you know how to create and assign tags, it's time to get an idea of what you can do with them. One of the most useful things you can do is apply these tags when filtering out jobs. To find a filter menu, head over to the jobs page. From here, go ahead and select filter results. You're gonna see a bunch of different options to choose from, but let's focus on the tag we just created, needs part pickup. And there's the job we just tagged. You can also filter out the jobs from the jobs report or the schedule page. Now let's move on to another awesome use case for tags, and that's triggering automated notifications using Workies Automations. Head over to the Automation Center by selecting the Settings gear icon in the navigation bar and then selecting Settings. Under General Settings, select Automation Center. We'll create a new automation from scratch by selecting Add Automation up here. We'll call this automation Part Pickup. We'll go, when a job is scheduled, send tech, a text message, and in that text we'll say, reminder, parts needed for this job. We'll go ahead and add some short code for the job type, the job description, which again includes the part information we entered earlier when editing the job, and then job ID in case the tech wants a bit more information. We'll hit save and close once the message is set. For within a defined time, we'll choose one day ahead of, and then the job date. Last thing we need to do is ensure the automation is triggered only when jobs are labeled with the tag we just created. We'll select add condition down here and say only if job tag is needs part pickup. We'll hit apply and then we're all set. Now, whenever a job is tagged with needs part pickup, our techs will automatically receive a text message to notify them that their assigned job needs an additional part. Here's a look at what that text message is gonna look like. Everyone's on the same page and you didn't need to go out of your way to make it happen. So that's it. You're all set to simplify your workflow using job tags. Feel free to subscribe to this channel for all the latest on how Workies can help improve your growing business. And as always, if you have any questions, we're here to help. Thanks for watching.